let's discuss the comparison test for the improper integrals of non-negative functions. What does it mean? This means that if we have two non-negative functions and one function is always less than or equal to g of x, remember both f and g are non-negative functions. It means both are greater than or equal to zero. But one function ki value for all the domain less than the other functions. So, this kind of comparison test we discussed in series sequences and in improper integrals we are discussing. Then, the convergence of one improper integral, let's say if f of x less than or equal to g of x, then if a to b improper integral g of x converge, then the smaller function will also converge. If the smaller function is improper integral f of x, आपका डाइवर्ज कर रहा है तो लार्जर फंक्शन g of x जो है उसका भी इंप्रॉपर इंटीग्रल जो है वो डाइवर्ज करेगा इसको हम स्टेट भी करते हैं और इसको बड़ा इजीली प्रूफ करेंगे इट्स वेरी इजी सो थ्योरम स्टेट्स दैट इफ f एंड g आर लोकली इंटीग्रेबल फंक्शंस ऑन दैट इंटरवल ab अब एक बात आपको मैं बता दूं कि यहां पे ab a की तरफ से ओपन इंटरवल है Similarly, you can do open interval A se bhi kar sakte hai. Analogous results jo hai, wo discuss nahi kar You can do it yourself. And furthermore, this is the non-negative condition. Ke 0 less than equals to f of x, non-negative. Agar g of x ki for all x in that interval, A, B, g of x hamesha greater hai. Toh of course, g of x bhi jo hai, wo greater than equals to 0 hoga. Okay? Then, we have the first thing, jo mene aapko bataya hai. If this thing Improper integral a to b gx dx is convergent because this non-negative function and non-negative function convergent we have said that we will decide less than infinity in the last module we have this term coin so the improper integral of f of x that will be also convergent so this is true yani ke improper integral a to b f of x dx convergent if a to b gx dx is convergent. Okay. Dusra case kya hai jo mene aapko badaya tha. Aap comparison test jo series sequences ke liye kya tha. Usse bhi aapko ek hint mil raha hai. Ki agar ye improper integral diverge karta hai. To iska improper integral jo hai wo bhi diverge karega. Ab non-negative functions jo hai. Inke integral agar divergent ho improper integrals jo hai. To wo diverge karta hai kisko positive infinity ko. So the integral improper integral of g of x is divergent if those jo smaller function hai f of x uska improper integral jo hai wo diverge kare aur divergent to f of x agar greater than equals to 0 hai so the improper integrals are always divergent to plus infinity isko prove karna hai let's prove this one ab improper integral for non negative functions उनके लिए हमने f of x जो है वो डिफाइन किया था a to x f of t dt अब इसका अगर ये फंक्शन f of x बाउंडेड है बाउंडेड है तो इंटीग्रल कन्वर्जेंट इंप्रॉपर इंटीग्रल a to b f of x dx ये कन्वर्ज करेगा और कन्वर्ज भी किसको करेगा इसकी सुप्रीमम वैल्यू को अगर अनबाउंडेड भी है तो तब तो डिवर्जेंट होगा ठीक है एंड डिवर्जेस टू इंफिनिटी होगा so we consider for both functions since due to this inequality we can have this is f of x and this is g of x g of x or f of x ke darmiyan ye relationship hold karega because the function are non negative iska matlab kya hua i can immediately conclude that ke supremum jo hai uske liye bhi yahi true hoga supremum of g of x this thing g of x jo maine is tarah define kiya hai इसकी सुप्रीमम जो है वो इसकी सुप्रीमम f of x की सुप्रीमम से लार्जर होगी बड़ी होगी सो द सुप्रीमम ओवर द इंटरवल a टू b b जो है ये ओपन है इस फंक्शन की सुप्रीमम लार्जर होगी इस फंक्शन की सुप्रीमम से ओके okay? अब बाय डेफिनेशन जो है बाय डेफिनेशन अगर ये कन्वर्जेंट है सुप्रीमम जो है ये फाइनाइट नंबर है so of course ye bhi ye infinite ho sakti hai ye infinite to ho hi nahi sakti kyunki inequality fir false ho jayegi so if this is convergent a to b f of x sorry g of x 
dx जो है this is convergent it means supremum जो ये चीज लिखी हुई है supremum x whenever x less than equals to b here should be less than not less than or equals to a to x g of t dt जो है ये finite number है ठीक है तो ये finite number होगा तो ये भी finite number होगा immediately I will conclude that a to b f of x dx is convergent convergent का क्या मतलब होता है that is it is less than infinity ये यहाँ पे explain किया हुआ है if a to b g x d x less than infinity means this integral improper integral is convergent the right hand side of this inequality is finite right hand side ये है by the previous theorem so the left side is also finite number this implies that integral a to b f of x d x less than infinity means it is convergent now second part जो था second part जो है इसका proof हम by contradiction करेंगे contradiction क्या है कि हम suppose कर लेते हैं कि g improper integral a to b g x d x जो है ये converge कर रहा ठीक है अब convergent होगा तो less than infinity a to b g of x d x less than infinity होगा अब अब अगर ये less than infinity है और हमारा जो है दूसरा function which is always less than or equals to g of x है तो वो तो infinity है तो infinity less than or equals to some finite number हो सकता है so we so we reached a contradiction so if f of x improper integral of f of x is divergent whenever f of x less than equals to g of x and both f and g are non negative functions then smaller function अगर जो है उसका improper integral diverge कर रहा है तो larger function जो है g of x जो हमारी इस मॉड्यूल में है वो भी डाइवर्ज करेगा हेंस वी हैव प्रूव्ड द स्टेटमेंट